you create a balloon. Get yourself a balloon, get yourself a tube, fill the tube very much with gas of CO2, water, put a straw through it, and inhale from this end. Let the air to go through the gas, fill the environment. This will do in your lung wonders in changing the strength of the radiation in your lungs. The radiation destruction of the cells in the lung will regenerate and will safeguard and secure the lung in a way that the growth of the lung cancer and even we have seen in some cases that the lung cancer does not come, but we see leukemia. Because the energy absorbed through the lung directly gets absorbed in the blood, and the blood through the lung becomes the source of leukemia. Change of gravitational magnetic field, the strength of the plasma of the blood of the man. So you make yourself an inhaler where the straw, go to McDonald's, go to any supermarket, get yourself a straw and put it through. If you go to game shops, if you go to toy places, you see these plastic tube sausages, which is a hole, you keep on pulling it and it keeps on changing with the liquid inside. Buy one of those, empty the water, add a CO2 gas into it, put a straw in the middle of it, you got yourself a system. Very cheap, very effective. You have to protect yourself in three ways. One is your skin. One is your inhaling, and one is through your digestion system. And using a CO2 in this way protects you in every way. By sitting in the gas of CO2 water, you protect and keep the strength of the T cells and B cells produced at a strength that the body can fight any radiation, any virus back up. It's an unknown fact in public, but radiation disasters, nuclear disasters, create what they call nuclear viruses. Unknown, never understood. They just call it the cancer. But in fact, these are radiation level viruses which can be created in the body of the man in a high exposure to radioactive material, radioactive sources. So the process is very simple. We have thought enough. All of you are masters in the space technology. All of you becoming masters in understanding. It's your responsibility to take action to safeguard your nationals, to teach. Just keep it at home. But my advice to you is never expose yourself to outside under no circumstances. If you have 